Hello, baseball fans, and welcome. We've got a perfect night for baseball on the show. It's the Oakland Athletics and the Los Angeles Angels. All right, we'll be back to get this one started after this. All right, just about set to go. And today's starter, Noah Syndergaard. Well, he comes at hitters with a five-pitch mix, so for him, it's always interesting to see how he utilizes those weapons. He may lean on one or two pitches, depending on how things are going and how things are working, but if he can control four or even five of those offerings, look out, hitters. It's going to be a tough day. He's really going to be able to keep those guys off balance. And that one is lifted in the air. No trouble here. Puts it away for the out. One away. Second, the shortstop. Here's Elvis Andrews. No score just getting started. Top of the first. Next offering misses, and it's two and one. And that's in for a strike. Now all leave it up. Swag and a miss. The velocity blasted it right past him. Not the best location with the fastball on strike three, but when you're pumping That's high good. 90s, you'll get away the with some of those. More margin Sean for error. You know, the Murphy. fastball has become such a huge strikeout pitch in the sport. And I think a lot of it has to do with all the attention and emphasis on improved spin rates. These fastballs are just exploding out of the pitcher's hands and jumping through the zone. Righty delivers. Right through there, got him. And that is that. Zero. Angels coming up. It's Major League Baseball, and it's on the show. Well, the key for him usually centers around his ability to command all four of his pitches. I mean, he can get by with three if one isn't working, but it becomes a little tougher to keep hitters guessing, especially when you start to get through the second and third time through the order. So we'll see how he incorporates all of his stuff into this one. And a one two. Swings and misses. One up, one down. Tell you what, those are the types of guys pitchers really like to punch out when they're on the mound Nine because seconds. if they no get on, field. just the distraction Nine. that they create with all that speed Whoa. over on the base pass, it could take away your focus from the next hitter. And that's the last thing you want to do is serve up a pitch that a guy hits over the fence, and it's a multi run home run. Next offering is downstairs. And the right-hander deals. Out to short. Throw on to Brown. Two up, two down. Batting third. The first baseman. And next for L.A., Jared Walsh. He's someone that really beats up on right-handed pitching. The lefties, however, give him a little bit more trouble. Next pitch misses, and it's two and two. Really good take, especially with two strikes. Line to second, snagged on the bounce. Kemp gets it to first. Walsh retired. And that's the go quietly there. Scoreless after one. Top of the second. So here's Brown at the plate. Next pitch is inside. And it's two and one. Two and one the count now. He hasn't seen a fastball yet, but you've got to be ready to hit one because you doubt the pitcher wants this to go to a 3-1 count. A foul ball, he stays alive. The wind of the pitch. And down on strikes he goes, and one gone. Well, that's a pitch, that slider from an opposite-handed pitcher that you usually see very well, but for some reason he didn't pick it up, and it just kind of got into the strike zone late, gave up on it a little bit early. Second inning here, no score stays alive oh. 
On the ground, right side. Tosses to the pitcher, covering the bag. Pitcher gets to the bag for the out. Two outs, base is empty. Now it's the right fielder, Steven Piscotti. Next offering is in for a strike. No score here in the second. Next pitch inside. And a full count now. And the righty deals. On the ground, right side. To first, but it pulls him off the bag. Looked to me like he got on the side of the ball a little too much right there. Maybe a little too casual as well with the throwing motion. And when you don't stay on top of the ball and really get out front and finish with a good release point, it's very easy to lose control of it to either side. Makes the grab, and that'll do it. Left for Oakland. We'll go to the bottom of the second. No score. And welcome back. Ready to go for the last half of the inning. And now the veteran third baseman, Anthony Rick. Oh, now this one's high and deep. Way back there. On its way. Gone. That fires up the home crowd. The Angels on the board first. It's 1-0. The pitcher knew as soon as that ball left his fingertips, it was trouble. Right on the platter, right down the heart of the plate. I'm sorry, but big league hitters don't miss that pitch. Here's Shohei Otani. And here it comes. Swung on, belted. That's back there. And out of here. Shohei Otani goes deep, and they add to the lead. It's 2 0. Back to back homers, always a special feeling at the ballpark, especially if it's your team that does it, and those guys get to slap hands at home plate. This is the kind of thing that can really fire up a ball club. Max Stassi comes up to hit. One and two now. And a foul ball. He stays alive. Oh, now this is blasted. Way back there. On its way. Gone. He'll touch them all. And they tack one on the board. It's 3-0. That's their third home run of the game. They're having a lot of fun at the plate in this one. They've got the long ball working for them on autopilot. Here's Joe Adele. And a pitch. That one hit to right. Piscotti settles underneath it. And there's one down. Batting eight. The second baseman. And now it's Matt, Matt. Duffy. Duffy. Here's a 1-1. One -one. Late on that fastball. Just not able to catch up to that velocity. Here's a 1-2. Now fly ball to right center. Dives and makes the catch. Cooper. This dive wasn't the result of a bad route, Siggy. The only reason he made the play is because his route was so good. No doubt, folks. StatCast tells the same story. I mean, he got to a spot as quickly as you can possibly get there. And he had to in order to have a chance at that diving play. Just special. Here's David Fletcher. That to right. And that one tracked down by Piscotti out in right field. They explode with three solo holes. On to the third inning. Striding to the plate now for Oakland, Kevin Smith. Well, after putting up a nice inning on offense, got some runs across, this is where you look for the starter to go out there, have a shutdown inning. Don't give that other team any hope. Uh, you just hope that he can get through this inning, get the bats back up there while they're hot. Batting done. I can watch base hits like that one all day long, and so could every hitting coach in the league. Just a nice line drive into center field. Syndergaard to throw over. Smith back easily. Here's Christian Pache. 
So a foul ball makes it one and two. Kicks and fires. Stays alive. On the ground left side. Six, four, three. And they turn the double play. Here's Tony Kemp. Second base. Tony Kemp. Got him. And good work there as he gets a one, two, three. As we go to the last of the third, Brandon Marsh steps to the plate. And a pitch. On the ground to third. That's a base hit. Man aboard on the leadoff single. Just a simple ground ball the other way. They've had eyes on now it, man. Sometimes that's all you need to do. Just let the ball travel, put the ball in play, and just hope wow. it finds a hole. And now they've got some speed on first, so we'll see if they try to get him into motion. Here's a drive out to right center. Way back there. Look out. Gone. He circles the bases, and they add a pair. It's five zip. That one was a hanger, and pitchers typically don't get away with making a mistake like that. And right there, he made him pay. And next for the Angels, Jared Walsh. Right-hander kicks, deals. Line drive, puts it away for the out. The third base. Now Number it's Anthony six. Rendon. Anthony. Still only one out here in the Rendon. inning. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. And there's two away. Two outs, base is empty. Shohei Otani up to the dish. Shohei. One one now. Otani. Fought off foul. And a foul ball, he stays alive. One and two here. Stays alive. Pitcher having a pretty tough time getting that swing and miss. Third foul ball in a row. And that one fouled off. Also really good at bat. What I like about this guy, his bat stays in the zone for a long time. Gives him the ability to foul off tough pitches. Out towards left center. Pinder makes the catch, and that'll do it. Angels do get one, however, on the Mike Trout home run. And the lead is now 5-0. All set for the start of the inning. Now the number two hitter, Elvis Andrews. Swing and a miss, and he struck him out. And he's down on strikes for the second time today. So here's the Murphy man. now. The catcher, Sean Murphy. Pitch misses inside. Two balls and a strike. Way out front for strike two. 2-2 two -two now. That one to first. Can't glove it cleanly, but plenty of time to recover, and that's the second out. Well, he's doing a nice job of now keeping back. the ball Double out of the three. air, lets the defense yeah. work behind him with another ground wow. ball. Good execution. Next offering is in for a strike. He's pitching well, but not throwing a ton of first pitch strikes. Usually doesn't work out for success, but you can never predict baseball. Next one just misses, and that's ball two. And a swing and a miss. And that's that. Hayes go. Ready to go. Bottom four. Here's the Angels catcher. Max Stassi. The wind of the pitch. Cut on and miss. Struck him out. And now one away. Man, I really like the ability to bounce back right there after not getting the call. He probably should have right got fielder. it. Didn't Number let seven. it affect his focus. And he Joe. came back with another good pitch oh, to Joe. get him swinging. And it's fouled away. 
The wind of the pitch. Out to short. Andrews handles. Over to first. Already two gone here in the home four. The batter, number five. So two down now, and here is Matt Duffy. And a count one and two. Two outs. Bounced out to short. Zips it to first, and that will end the inning. Angels go down one, two, three. New inning, get it. started now it's the DH Jed Lowry next pitch has popped up no trouble here puts it away for the out and there's one down the batter the right fielder Steven Piscotti here's Steven Piscotti Well, on the mound, very efficient, able to produce an outcome, it seems like, within the third or fourth pitch of just about every at-bat. The punch out there picks up strikeout number seven. Really love the pitch sequence right there. I'm telling you what, pitcher and catcher on the same page right now. now. And now, Chad, Chad Pinder. Pinder. Hard hit, right side. Has some trouble with it. Not in time. Great effort, but it's an infield hit. The third baseman, number one, Kevin Smith. Digging in for Oakland, Kevin Smith picked up a base hit to center his first time up. The 1 1 popped up. Fletcher makes the catch, and that'll do it. The A's strand one. Back here at Angel Stadium, bottom of the inning, and the batter will be the shortstop, David Fletcher. Here comes a pitch. That two-seam fastball is usually coupled with a slider away, and when a hitter's conscious of the pitch in, it's hard for him to cover middle away, and that's where a pitcher can really finish off that batter. Strike two. Do that fastball right by him, slightly elevated. That's a confidence boost for this guy out there on the mound. See if he continues to climb the ladder. Out to center. Racing makes the catch. And there's one down. Now batting. No left Back fielder. to the top of the Angels Brandon. lineup. Brandon Marsh, the next to hit for the Angels. Ground ball up the middle. Whips it to first on the run. Barely got him for the out. Close play. Here's Trout. Great speed and great power. A great athlete, quite simply. Wow. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. Third out, and that ends the frame. All set for the top of the sixth. Striding to the plate now for Oakland, Christian Pache. When you have a real athletic player and who's able to do the baseball mechanical things really well, look out because the sky's the limit on that potential. Base hit. So a runner aboard to start the inning. Just one of those seen eye base hits ball. through the infield. Second just kind of rolled over on it a little bit, but sometimes yeah. those can find a hole and get you a knock. Tap dances out of the way of that one. At the belt and fires. And that one hammered back there. Pulls it in on the warning track. Man at first, here's the shortstop at Elvis. the play. Elvis Andrews. On the ground to the left, and that's a fair ball. Lead runner holds at third, so two runners in scoring position, and just one out. 
catcher. Here's Sean Murphy. Sean. And the pitch. He swings and fouls one off. The pitch. That's out to center field. Base hit. One run is in. Throw comes in and holds the runner at third. They're at the corners now with still only one away. Stepping in, Seth Brown. Seth. Oh, now this one is blasted to right. Forget it. Way back there and gone. Seth Brown goes deep, and they're chipping away. It's 5-4. Well, that swing changes things. Yes, it does. They were in striking distance. They found a way to fight back big time. So one out, nobody. Here's Jed Lowry. Left hand batter waits. On the ground. Rendon picks it up. Score at 5 3 for the second out with the third baseman shifted over there. Now batting. The right fielder, Steven. Next up for the Piscotti. A's, Steven Piscotti. To the right side. Oh, can't pick it up cleanly. He doesn't have a play, and they don't get an out on the play. The left Two left outs, left runner at first. Yeah. Chad Pinder now. Pinder. The pitch. That one misses. Two and one. Go with the tie and run at first base. He's looking for something he can get a lot of barrel on. Drive it into a gap and score that run from first base. They take the force out. That'll end the inning after a lot of scoring. A's draw closer on this homer. It's now a 5-4 ball game. Grant Holmes into the game, and he'll do his best to keep this close. Well, at this point in the ball game, we're talking about middle innings, and he made a little length out of this arm coming out of the bullpen. We'll see just how many outs he's able to give his skipper. And he hits a ground ball right side. Whips it to first. And that's one out as they get the leadoff hitter in the six. The third baseman, number six, Anthony Rizzo. One down, base is empty. Rendon stands in here. Tried to hold back his swing there, but went around. Swings through that, and it's a strikeout. Two away. Now back the designated hitter, Shohei Otani. And that one lifted in the air center field. Pache under it. That is the inning. And the Angels are gone in. We go to the top of the seventh. Digging in for Oakland, Kevin Smith. Manager out of the dugout, and he's going to make a change. Here comes Ryan Tapera to the hill, and he'll work on holding this lead. The 1 1. Never down the right side, but foul. On the ground to first. Takes it himself, and a quick out, number one. Up next for Oakland. The center field and now Christian, Christian Pache. Pache the tying run at the plate swings through that one trying to keep good speed off the bases next offering is foul back got him two out no, that's not the best two-strike fastball I've seen, but certainly got away with the location there. The you know, sometimes the as a hitter, when you're down in the count, you're so focused on a pitcher painting the black, and you just get a little bit locked up on something down the heart of the plate, not expecting it, and it just kind of freezes you. Swing and a drive. This one, way back there. Going. That one is gone. We are tied. 
right. That'll fire up the dugout, and we're all square. It's 5-5. Five, five. Just an excellent swing all the way around, and it had that sound coming off the bat that gets everyone's attention. Got a pitch to drive, short to the baseball, squared it up, and the backspin carried it out of here. And the batter now, Elvis Andrews. Next offering is in for a strike. Puts the squeeze on that one, and that'll end the inning. One scores in the inning coming on this solo home run. All even at five apiece. Bottom of the seventh at the play. Max Stassi. And it's even up. And downstairs. At this point in the game, you cannot issue free passes. He's going to have to challenge this hitter. Hitter's got to be ready to swing it. Ripped on a line to center. Pache makes the grab. And there's one down. Good piece of hitting right there. Nice hard line drive to the outfield. You're trying to get on base, represent that go-ahead run. Can't hang your head on that at all. Up the middle, Andrews picks it up. He is safe, and that was bang, bang at first. Did a nice job now getting there. Good throw, but very back. difficult to get anybody on that one as far as you had to go and throw. You know? Yeah, no question. And there's a hit. But there's no play. That's an infield single. Anything but pretty right there, but he'll take it every time. Jammed it pretty good with that high fastball on the inside corner, so he can't be upset about the pitch. Just kind of an unlucky result. Now a good opportunity to potentially jump ahead in this game here in the later innings. Two on, one out. Now it's the shortstop, David Fletcher. Base hit right field. Runner around third on his way to the plate. Throw home, he beats it, and it's 6-5. Just so sound in his mechanics. Hits against a firm front side, and the hands just continue to carry through the middle of the field. They say it went. Looking for some insurance, or as our friends down in the south would say. Insurance. No matter how you say it, we know what you mean. Two on, one out. Left field. No trouble here. Puts it away for the out. Two down. The center field, number 27. Mark Brown. Here's a 1-1. One, one. Swing and a ground ball up the middle. That's a base hit. Duffy around third. The throw home. In there. He scores. It's 7-5. Got the job done to put him up by two. Just kept it simple. Played Pepper with the middle of the infield and took it back where it came from, and there's just no one there to knock it down. Sam Mole gets the call from the pen. It's his job to keep his team in the game. And now here is Jared Walsh. That one back up the middle, and it gets through. Right past his coach, headed for the plate. The throw's offline. He's saved. It's 8-5. to five. Back-to-back -back base hits, just a cookie down the middle. I mean, those are the ones you dream about. Ones in the cage, you're just hoping you get in the ball game. Right down the middle, not a whole lot of velocity, right on top of it. On the ground, right side. Fires over to first. That takes care of Rendell. That ends the inning. Back here at the ballpark, we're at the top of the eighth. And now here's the A's catcher, Sean Murphy. Next offering is in for a strike. Well, it's critical right here that they bear down and turn in some quality at bats, try to chip away at that lead, because if it gets to the ninth, that closer's coming in. Adele settles under this one, makes the grab one away. Seth Brown up next for the A's. He's already homered here in this one. And down on strikes. That's out number two. Here's Lowry now. The batter. The 2 1. Designated hitter. And he flips a breaking ball in there or a changeup. 
Either one. <laughs> Something off speed. Good arm action on it. Whatever it was. Swing and a ball lifted left field. And that should be extra bases. And that rolls into the corner. And that's a double. You've got to get on your horse and get to that thing and get it back in because he's going to come barrel around first. He's going to put pressure on you. If you bobble it or you don't get there in a hurry, he's going to make you look silly and end up on second base. Right-handed reliever. That's to third. Can't field it cleanly. And he beats it. That's a hit. Great try there. Man, he just absolutely turned on that one. Ripped it down the line. Nice job of staying in his mechanics. Got to keep things airtight defensively right here. On your toes, ready to make a play. If you can get this to the ninth with a three-run lead, it should be a W. Swing and a miss. And that is that. Home half of inning number eight straight ahead. Ready for the bottom of the eighth. And now the Desi. Left hand hitter waits. And now this one's a rocket to right. Way back there. Gone. An absolutely majestic shot. He's done it again. His second homer of the game. And they add on. It's 9-5. For a pitcher, the odds are in your favor if you keep that breaking ball down. That time, he got punished for it. Hitter just did a really good job of staying within himself and getting the barrel to the baseball. Now here is Max Stassi up the middle. Andrews handles the chance. The throw to first, and that's the first out. Nice recovery after giving up the homer. Joe Adele, the next to hit for the Angels for the fourth time tonight. Liner stagged at first. So in now for the Angels, Matt Duffy. The pitch. And a foul ball. He stays alive. Ground ball up the middle. That's a base hit. Gotta love the resiliency he showed in that at bat, battling with two strikes. Pitch was on the outside, didn't go the other way with it, but still a nice job of using the big part of the field to find a hole. No way he hits it that well if he hooks around the baseball there. And it drops in. Throw in holds the lead runner at second. Two on now with two away. So the batting order turns over. Brandon Marsh digs in now, stays alive. Duffy over at second. Fletcher on at first with two down. Fly ball down the line. A little move single. Duffy around third. He will score. And the lead is up to five. That's three singles in a row. Just a loop hit behind third right there. And that's a really tough play for a third baseman or shortstop to get to. And the same for the left fielder. So. He just found a perfect place to drop that one in right there. On to pitch now for Oakland, Danny Jimenez. He comes in with his team trailing by a bunch, so he'll try to keep it where it is. This one in the air right field, and that one tracked down by Piscotti out in right field. Ninth inning coming up. It's the Angels 10 and the A's 5. Welcome back. Here's the third baseman, Kevin Smith. So the Angels turn to their bullpen for a new pitcher, Mike Myers. And a healthy sized lead for him to go to work with.
kicks and deals. One up, one down. Now, now here is Christian Pache. Christian Pache. Next offering is foul back. And a foul ball, he stays alive. One, two now. In the air, right field. Adele racing over to make the catch. So the lineup flips over. Tony Kemp up next for the A's. And the pitch. Called strike right there. Is just one strike away. That one ripped. That's back there. He's got it. Ball game. And the Angels slug their way to a win in this one. When you hit five balls out of the yard, you expect to win. Some teams live and die by the long ball. Today, these five homers, they really led them to victory. And your final 10 